Hello everyone, and thank you for joining us for the secondary monthly assembly for February of 2021. Uh, this month, the global competency that we'll be focusing on is Take Action. And uh, for that section of this presentation, we'll be looking at a music video that was created by two of our grade 11 students. The uh, student learner profile characteristic that we'll be focusing on this month is self-directed productive learners. And, you know, this is something we've all been working really hard at perfecting this year. Uh, for 2020, 2021, we've been online for almost the entire year and, you know, it takes a lot of self-directed focus in order to uh, manage your distractions and organize information and, and to do a good job in online learning. And so I think in, in that aspect, we're all kind of winners in that category. After, uh, after I'm done introducing, we'll jump into the Thalun song first. And following the Thaloon song, we will look at a uh, featurette of all of the activities that um, have been going on in our visual and performing arts classes this past month. And after that, we will look at a short, uh, you know, outtakes from the professional, or sorry, student uh, personal development day that we ran on February 5th of this month and uh, some of the things that we got to learn about. So thank you again for joining us and enjoy the video.
My name is Anne Marie, and I'm your host for the second episode of The Den. Hopefully everybody's enjoying the assembly. Uh, before we move on with uh, global competencies and uh, learner profile, I wanted to mention some of the upcoming events for March in, at Falun. So on March 2nd is Peasants Day and so there will be no school on Peasants Day. So, uh, you know, relax. Uh, March 4th and 5th will be parent-teacher conferences and those will be an adjusted bell schedule days. Uh, so uh, we will go to school until 12.30 and then we will have parent-teacher conferences in the afternoon. Um, so uh, hope to see you there at the parent-teacher conferences. Uh, March 15th is a uh, teacher professional development day. So again, there will be no school. That's a Monday. Um, on March 18th is the end of the third quarter of the year and the beginning of the fourth quarter and uh, we still have school on that day but it's just transitioning to a new period and our uh, reports will be sent out shortly after that and then March 26th is Armed Forces Day. So the, the next part of the assembly is to talk about our global competencies and this month's global competency is take action and uh, yeah, in the framework that we use to talk about our global competencies, there's four parts. There's investigate the world, recognize perspectives, communicate ideas, and take action. And so this month we're focusing on take action, which means I take action for collective well-being and sustainable development, both locally and globally. And uh, this month, as a little um, example of how our students are taking action, we have a music video by uh, Nyat and James, two students in our high school, grade 11, who made a music video to go on a website um, where uh, the host of the website has written a song and people all over the world uh, do recreations of this song and it's, it's kind of to share this message of, uh, you know, making the world a better place. So uh, without further ado, I'd like to share that video with you. Enjoy. Better times, better times will come. Better times, better times will come. When this world learns to live as one, Oh, better times will come. Challenging, you may you no sad time. She had no nunya ya, la mama. Sisso de monda in the color Oh, better times will come. Learns to live as one. Oh, better times will come. Ni a die, I now so lonely. 
student learner profile and every month we hand out an award uh, to a student in each class that personifies that, uh, that characteristic, that learner profile characteristic. And this month we're doing self-directed uh, productive learners. And um, you know, like I said earlier in the video, this is really important uh, now that we're doing distance learning and that so many things are going on in our world. and. Um, you know, this skill is being called upon by our students more frequently than maybe ever in the past. And, um, you know, we're really proud of all of the students, all of them. And even though we're, we're just giving a certificate to one student in each class, um, you know, we would like to congratulate all the students, uh, you know, for making the right cho uh, choices, for setting goals, uh, for deciding how to proceed in certain circumstances, for planning, for being curious and willing to try new things, uh, for viewing problems as challenges and desiring to change uh, and enjoying your learning, even though we all know, you know, it's just, for most of us anyways, it's just not as fun, it's not as engaging to learn online, but you are embracing it. Um, you know, you search for information using, you know, all kinds of different sources. We're asking you to process information in new ways and different ways. Um, you know, I, I see people pursuing their own interests more, um, you know, and uh, so we wanted to just say that we recognize that you're all, you know, trying to embody this characteristic and we think that everybody's doing a great job. Uh, but. We wanted to recognize one student from each class that the teachers nominated to say, you know, this student is doing a really outstanding job. So in grade six, uh, Christine was nominated. Congratulations, Christine. For grade seven, we had Davin. Davin, congratulations. Uh, grade eight, Priscilla. Congratulations, Priscilla. Grade nine, Augustine. Good job, Augustine. Grade 10, we had Wasso. Congratulations, Wasso. Grade 11, Ricky. Keep up the good work, Ricky. And in grade 12, we had Edward. So thank you to all of those students and we'll email you a copy of the certificate. Um, but congratulations to everybody. And thank you for joining us uh, for this February assembly. And uh, have a good March. See you at the end of March, bye.